What I enjoy most about working for our company is the opportunity to work with so many scientists internally as well as um, within the external scientific community and exchange that information with them and really share that same mission to invent and bring forward new medicines that help improve our patients' lives. So as a physician um, with subspecialty training, I was recruited really for those subspecialty skills. But then once you get into the company, there's so many opportunities. And again, I felt like I had no business acumen. I didn't understand financial spreadsheets. And I, it was all about the science. But you learn, um, you learn a whole new skill set here, which is so different from being in academic medicine that it creates new opportunities. What excites me about oncology is that there are so many different areas uh, within oncology. Uh, one of the, the areas that we focus here in here in our organization is uh, in immuno-oncology and just understanding how early in, in the science we are in terms of discovery and being part of an organization that is uh, growing and, and, and coming up with innovative data and science almost on a recurring basis. That growth is a testament to the growth of our organization within medical affairs as well. From my point of view, medical affairs sits at the intersection between the patient and the provider and the science. The science, it doesn't help anybody unless it's implemented properly. Drugs can't help people unless they're studied properly. And so it's our job to get the information about what the real world needs and how the real world treats patients, translate it so that the research is done properly. And then once the research is done, we can then translate it back into how to improve patient outcomes. I see nothing more exciting than the ability to impact patients' lives, to be able to change medical practice, and that's the work of medical affairs.